Today we build a fake stone picture frame for a marble puzzle. My kids and I really enjoyed finishing this marvel puzzle and we were looking for a way to hang it on the wall. From a recent renovation project we had some leftover XPS foam. We used the CNC to make a special frame, but the material is so easy to shape that you could also use a handheld router or a Dremel. The CNC program is created in FreeCAD and rather simple. After the facing operation, the CNC removes a bit more material from the area where the puzzle will be mounted, so that it sits flush with the frame. Next, we cut a groove around the perimeter and cut the form free, leaving tabs that hold the foam in place. And the surface finish of the CNC is a bit rough, so I sand all visible parts of the foam smooth. With a ball of tin foil, I give the frame a bit of structure by rolling the tin foil over the frame. To protect the soft XPS and cover the green color, I mix PVA glue with black acrylic paint. The mixture is then applied to the frame and creates a hard surface. With a piece of kitchen sponge, I apply some white, brown and mud-like color. After these colors have dried, I cover most of the color with a light gray. By applying the gray with a sponge, not all the areas are covered and you get a pattern that looks similar to stone with inclusions. While the grey color is drying, let's take care of the puzzle itself by first sliding a sheet of parchment paper under the puzzle to protect the table. I apply a few coats of PVA glue thinned down with water so it's easier to spread it with a roller. The glue dries hard and transparent. It also creates enough of a bond to move the puzzle as one piece. Next I apply glue to the foam surface and then carefully move the puzzle onto the back side and let the glue dry. After the glue is dry, the frame gets one more protective coat of watered down PVA glue and then the puzzle frame is ready to be hung on the wall. Hanging the puzzle is my favorite part. Just hammer two nails in the wall and clip off their heads. The foam is so light that the nails can easily hold the weight. Just press the foam into the nails and it will stay in place. This was a bit of a different project than usual. My original idea was to use wood and I'm quite happy with that unusual material choice. Sometimes it's fun and rewarding to try out new ways. If you want to hang your picture on a slanted wall, I also have a video for that. Have a look!